we're building a country-sized economy on the basis of free, of giving things away free to consumers. This is an economy based on a price of zero dollars and zero cents. Never in human history have we seen a country-sized economy where the underlying driving force was not monetary, but instead non-monetary forces, reputation, attention, etc. And yet this economy is making plenty of people rich and providing um, you know, healthy revenue flow flows for lots of companies. So this paradox of an economy built on free that is nevertheless one that you can make money in is the central question of the book. Are there really economies? You know, can you treat them like money? Is there a, is there a, is there a, a money supply of reputation and attention? Is there an Alan Greenspan of reputation and attention? You know, is, it, is, it, is it really analogous? Um, I think there is. I'm not sure. You know, we're still trying to figure out exactly how to, how to measure it. But let me give you some, some you know, starting, starting perspectives. Um, the core of the reputation and attention economy is Google, um, because that's how we convert the two. So we, um, to, to just throw out some units, um, we measure attention online in terms of traffic, just how many page views do you get. And then we monetize that traffic by putting advertising up against it. And so we know what our CPM is. And so we could sort of say, so you know, the conversion rate between attention and reputation is $20 per thousand. OK, there. You just got a conversion rate. That's like the conversion between euros and dollars. We now have conversions between attention units and dollar units. Um, 20 CPM, 5 CPM, you know, it, it depends on your sector. But we do have conversion rate. OK, that's pretty easy. Now let's do reputation. What's the unit of reputation? Once again, Google comes to our aid. We have page rank. So my page rank of, let's say, one of my sites is six. Six is determined by how many incoming links. In other words, the collective you know, opinion out there, all those other people who, who you know, chose where to, what to link to, some, enough of them have linked to me that my page rank has gone to six out of a scale of 10, um, which means I've got a pretty good reputation. So what do I do with that? Well. That means that my site is going to come up pretty high on search results. So if you Google my site, it'll come up on the first page. And that means I'll get lots of traffic via search. And remember that traffic, we already know how to convert that to money via advertising. So now we have a direct conversion. So reputation is measured by incoming links, which we quantify in page rank. Page rank turns into higher results in organic search. And our higher results in organic search turns into traffic. And we turn traffic into money through ads. So there we basically mapped reputation, attention, and monetary economies along a, along a continuum, and we have conversion rates for each.